Okay, guys, here's where we are with the Robotron. I haven't touched the side, but I think I'm going to leave this alone. I'm going to save it for a better day after the baby's born. Uh, these are Everything's just dry-fitted. I haven't secured anything down. I had to get another joystick, order another joystick, because the one that I was working on was actually rusted to the joystick, so I couldn't get it out of the grommet without destroying the casing. There's my new bezel, new marquee, repainted. I did paint right here, make it look better. And tomorrow I'm gonna paint the back doors and try to find the coin door. I know I have it because I bought one. Anyway, that's about where we are. I just wanna see how this is gonna go with the, uh, I have a headset on tonight. I was just testing to see how it's going to look with the, uh, it's going to look gorgeous. That would be a nice game. I'm going to put it in between, uh, I think I'm going to move Joust over here. And then put Robotron over here where Big uh, Burger Time is. And then put Burger Time over here so you can see it better. And I'm not sure I'm going to do a Popeye yet. I just I brought all my games from the garage down here and I got a burn free monitor there, but nobody's ever seen one before. It's I believe it's a eighty three oh four Wells. Anyway, if anyone knows anything about it, let me know. Right, everything's a mess right now. I gotta replace the coil and the uh oh. End of stroke switch on uh, Super Mario Brothers. All right. And then this is, I've already showed you guys this, but no, pole position and rush to rock. Rush to rock needs a cap kit. And pole position just needs to get the, is next on the list here. Well, it might go behind Paper Boy. Yeah, it's going to go behind Paper Boy. All right. Night.